So the question says Sonu has five nodes of different denominations and Monu has ten nodes of different denominations. If Sonu gives one node to Monu, then average money per denomination with Sonu will increase by two, and that will more with Monu decrease by one. So Sonu has five nodes of denomination. So let us say Sonu has five nodes, and the average money is A. Monu has ten nodes. And let us say the average here is B. Sonu gives one note to Monu, then average money per denomination with Sonu will increase by two. So if Sonu gives a note to Monu, of course Monu will now have eleven notes. Sonu will now have four notes. He says average of Sonu it increases by two, and average of Monu it decreases by one. So can I say previously the total money with Sonu was five A, with Monu was ten B. Now the total money with Sonu is 4a plus 8, with Monu is 10b, sorry, 11b minus 11, and the total money with them should be equal because ultimately money just went from one person to other. The total money would not change. From here I am getting a 10b minus b is minus b is equal to minus 3, or I can say b minus a is equal to 3. I am getting b minus a. Is equal to three. So this is all the information that I have till now with us. Okay. So this is the only info. So let's have a look at the questions. What is the difference between the original average money per denomination with Sonu and Monu? With Sonu, the original average money was A. With Monu, it was B. We just saw the difference between them was three. Basically, A minus B is minus three, or B minus A is three. The difference is always called as three. So the right answer for question number six is clear. It is equal to three. Right, and when I move on to question number seven, what is the value of the note given by Sonu to Monu if the sum of the original average per denomination with them was thirty-nine? Now the original average with Sonu was A, with Monu was B. He says their sum was equal to thirty-nine, and now I see that B minus A is equal to three. So from that, if I just solve it, let's just add them. You get two B is equal to forty-two. That means A is twenty-one. And if I put A as 21, I get B is equal to 18. That means initially Sonu had 18 notes, sorry, uh, average 18 of five notes, and Monu had an average of 21 with 10 notes. So now Sonu has got an average of 16, sorry, 20, because his average increased by two. The number of notes with him is four because he gave one note to Monu. From here only I can say that initial amount with Sonu was 90, and the new amount with Sonu is 80. So I see his amount has actually decreased by ten. Why is it decreased by ten? He gave that ten rupee note to Monu. So that's what the question is asking us: value of the note given by Sonu to Monu. It is equal to ten rupees. That's the right answer for question number seven.